Thank you. Well, thank you. Wow. Thank you again. Wow, you're, a, you're too good almost. Good, I'm glad. It's great to be back here in my uh, hometown, New York. I've been traveling and the crowds aren't as good. I was in, actually I was in uh, Montreal, Canada last week. Very, yeah, uh-huh. Beautiful city. I learned some French there. They're all bilingual. That's what amazed me in, in Montreal. I went into a uh, Burger King. The Burger King employees are required to be bilingual. Which, just think about that for a second, folks. Have you, have you been to Burger King in New York? Yeah, they're not even lingual here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> a little different in New York. You have to kind of draw your food here. Hamburger. I'd like a hamburger. <laughs> hamburger. I am to go. I'm gonna go. <laughs> Take it out. Here, I'll put little feet on my hamburger. They're, they're bilingual. I go there quite often to Burger Kings, McDonald's. I have uh, children. I have to take them somewhere. I have, uh, yeah. I have a three-year-old daughter and twin two-year-old boys. Wow. <laughs> Thank you. Single people are here. <laughs> Single people love, yay, twins. Uh, parents, uh, oh, that could have been us. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh. I'll tell you, you know, it doesn't matter if you laugh or not, I'm just happy to be out of the house right now. I'll be honest with you. I will be honest. <laughs> you know, it's horrible. I make little excuses now just to get out of my house for a few minutes. I'll do anything. Anybody, you need anything? Anything at all, anything? What you, anything from the Motor Vehicle Bureau? How about that? Can I register something? It's on my way. I'm going that way. I'm just going to go apply for jury duty. That's all. <laughs> Let me out. I have to leave my house just to make phone calls now. You can't, no one really wants to talk to you on the phone when you've got kids running around. Every business call I try to make, I screw up eventually. Oh yeah, oh yeah, the 15th is fine. I just need to know where do you think you're going with that cookie? <laughs> Put the cookie down. <laughs> Not you, sorry. Sorry, I didn't mean to scare you. I, oh, I didn't know you were eating a cookie. Take it easy. Click. Thank you. Yeah. Wow. The hardest, I'll tell you, the hardest thing to do now is to try to sit down and write jokes because all I do is try to make them laugh all day. That's what happens when you're a parent, you're a comedian for them. I can make them laugh. I can make an infant laugh in a second. I tell you, I'm losing my perspective on adult humor. It, I wrote one new joke since my twins were born. Here, is this funny? What do you think it is? Hi. <laughs> Hi, everybody. All right. Thank God. I'm glad. I'm glad you laughed. If you didn't laugh at that, I would have had to come and rub my nose in your bellies. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, then forget it. The show runs late. <laughs> identical twins. I'm glad they're identical because you save money on photographs. That's what I like. Yeah, that's what I like. There's my little boy, and I got another one just like it. <laughs> I don't have another picture. <laughs> People think. People always see identical twins and they think they're cute. Let's face it, some babies aren't cute. But if you have two that look alike, that's cute to everybody. Well, I'll tell you what frightens me. That isn't gonna apply when they become adults. I really, I hope they're handsome as adults because even if they're slightly ugly, that's gonna be magnified. That's gonna, <laughs> it will. It, you know, if you see one slightly ugly man walk across the room, that's no big deal. But if you see the same ugliness right behind him, yeah, that you're gonna notice. You will notice that. And a three-year-old daughter. Let's not forget her. Yeah, that's the age to be three. I'll tell you, I always thought if I could go back in time, I'd want to be a teenager. I'd go right to three. You don't get happier. You can't get happier than three. I watch my daughter. It's incredible. The other day, she's staring out the car window for 15 minutes, just smiling at nothing. Yeah. Oh, I can't get over it. Finally, I turn. Alexandra, what are you thinking of? 
Candy. <laughs> candy, yeah, well, think of when was the, the last time you could daydream about candy, folks. <laughs> Try that. Try it as an adult. You can't. <laughs> you can't. Give it a shot one time as an adult. You won't get far. Oh, candy, candy, cavities. Oh, <laughs> dentist, no money. Who am I? Why am I here? Am I gay? 